Bar magnets, with their clearly indicated north and south poles, have long been used in physics lessons on electricity and magnetism to help explain the shape and nature of the Earth's own magnetic field. In this video, we will show some of the different ways this has been done in the past, along with an updated method that better illustrates the three-dimensional nature of magnetic fields. This is a typical bar magnet, with its north pole painted red and stamped with an N, and its south pole painted blue and stamped with an S. To better uh, help in this demonstration, though, we've mounted a slightly smaller version of a bar magnet on the underside of a, of a viewing table. One of the easiest ways to show the shape of a magnetic field is to sprinkle iron filings along the sides and ends of the magnet as is shown here. You can clearly see that it does follow the shape of the magnetic field. Another way is to simply place compasses uh, in similar locations around the magnet and we make sure that they work and as you can see the compasses outline the field the same way as the iron filings do. But both these techniques show only the two-dimensional uh, pattern that is not really indicative of, of a true magnetic field. A third way using the Mark II magna probe helps visualize the 3D shape of a magnetic field. A magna probe is simply a and an Alnico bar magnet, which has its own poles stamped and marked uh, blue and red for north and south. Uh, it floats freely so that it can outline a magnetic field in three dimensions. And this can be seen when one simply passes this around the uh, viewing table and you can see that it follows the shape of the magnetic field the same way. If you move it above, it does the same thing. If you move it down below, it does the same thing. And this, as you can appreciate, gives you a, a better um, appreciation for uh, the structure of a magnetic field.